If we could please get a cheer for the fabulous Brett Crow pre-show. For those of you who were not with us last week, Brett, after a couple of years of being with us, has released his first album. Uh, I've listened to it. It is awesome. Please talk to him after the show. Do you still have copies left? There are still copies left, so pop by and say hello to him. In the meantime, are you people ready to get the show on the road? No, no, we're not doing a road show. It's too much lifting. Ladies and gentlemen, Alica Theater! We just, we just got started. We haven't even gotten up to speed yet. Who's never done this before? Can I hear a quick cheer from who? Okay, Strand, the first thing you do is turn on your spotlight. Awesome. <laughs> Secretly, we do a little tech training on the side. I don't know. That was illuminating. <laughs> He's not very bright. Well, he is now. <laughs> we were doing... TJ says no. He forgot the note, uh, the note we gave. We have a theatrical note for you, Mr. Strand. Stop. There it is. All right. For those of you who have never done it before, can I hear a cheer from you? A handful of you. Welcome to what may be the nuttiest thing going on in theater. The first thing you really need to know is there is no fourth wall. Please be a part of this madness. To the rest of you, yeah, we're back for another week. Uh, for those of you who, uh, who are new around here, you don't know that we are simultaneously working on a show called Almost Five at the Bathhouse Cultural Center. <laughs> some of you have already seen it. Some of you are getting tickets and have come by to say, don't freak out, I'm coming to see you this week. Thank you so much. We have worked so incredibly hard on that, on this at the same time, maintaining our promise of keeping the show going in the interim. It means so much. On a personal note, you know, you build the set, you rehearse the show, you do the stunts, you do the costumes, you hope it all works. We had no idea what a theater audience was gonna do with us, and I wished I could pack all of these people up in a box and take them with me. And, and what I didn't know is that they had already planned to. When we got there, the front two rows of every single show last week was filled with you guys. And I just have to say thank you. And, and, this, and this, is the, this is the story. We do the show, the show's really good, and it's a lot of fun. When we get done, uh, Charlie, Charlie is the director, hey Charlie, uh, Charlie is the director of the theater department at the Bathhouse Cultural Center. He is an honorary roustabout as far as I'm concerned. He worked so hard to make everything easy for us. But when we got done, he walked up and he pulled me into his office. And he goes, no, and he closes the door, he says, I have to ask you a question. I said, and I figured we were in trouble. I didn't know what we had done. He said, did you put actors in the front row? And I, I told him the truth. I said, no, but we trained the audience really well here for, you know, three and a half years. But the fact of the matter is, a big part of what we do, just like we do here and you're about to see, is based on audience participation. And without you guys, it just wouldn't work. So thank you. And let's practice a little more right here at the open stage. Welcome. Woo! 